it's really hot. I feel like because I have tons of lights on right now, it's really hot. But anyways. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm Stryker, if you don't know me. Well, my mom calls me Stryker, so whatever. Um, my name is still up in the air. Anyways, hey guys, what's going on? In today's video, I'm doing something a little different. I figured I would do a spring styling video because right now where I live, it's kind of like we're in the middle of like winter and spring. We have like our really cold days and then we have really hot days. So um, I figured it would be like a little mix of both and like a really cool way to transition from winter to spring. Um, so I hope you guys really enjoy the video. But before we get started, I wanted to give a super quick shout out to Friendzone. <laughs> this is my best friend's sister's company or brand, whatever you want to call it. Um, I keep meaning to do a photo shoot, but I just have like no time in my life. Um, they did like a big photo shoot, probably like a couple weeks back, maybe a month or so now, but I had like a huge winter storm where I live at the time, so I couldn't make it. Um, so figured I would do a quick shout out now. If you guys are interested in checking out this apparel, then you can go ahead to their Instagram, which I will link in the caption below. The front is super cute. They make them in tons of colors. And then the back, um, I think you can expect, I don't know if they're gonna do swimsuits, but I know they're probably gonna do like a spring clothing thing coming soon so yeah you definitely have to check them out but with that being said let's just jump into my video this first outfit is based around these shorts and i call them biker shorts but they're just like yoga pants that were cut off and mine are from forever 21 paired up with this hoodie that i got from target for my shoes i thought i'd wear these vans because i never get the chance to wear them and i thought the colors looked really nice with the sweatshirt then i also paired up this outfit with like my sock sneakers whatever you want to call them they are from macy's and i thought they looked cute with this outfit as well next leaving the shorts on i'm just going to throw on this long sleeved long john shirt that i cut myself i cut it a little too short but i still love it then for shoes i thought i could either wear my black high tops or my old style adidas sneakers i think the black ones really give it a sporty look but at the same time i feel like my white sneakers also give it a really cool look so it's kind of up to you and you know however you feel I feel like white t-shirts are so underrated, like I absolutely love them because they go with anything, you know, whether it's a v-neck or not. Um, I thought it looked really cute with these shorts, whether you decide to just leave it down regular or tie it up like I did. I always find myself tying up my t-shirts, but it adds a little extra pizzazz. And I didn't end up putting on any jewelry throughout this whole video, but of course that would add to this outfit if you feel it's too plain. Then I grabbed these white Birkenstock looking sandals from Target. They were like $13, so it was definitely a steal. Next, this tank top that I picked up from Macy's. Um, I know it's kind of like long and it looks old styled um so what i like to do is kind of you know pick it up and fold it in half like i just showed and then the more wrinkles you leave the less it looks folded um but if you don't want to wear it like this which sometimes i don't depending on how the tank top looks whenever it's folded like this um you know i could always throw on a jacket especially if it's a chillier spring day this is an under armor jacket that i picked up from tj maxx Okay, this is the last thing I'm going to pair these shorts up with. I just really like them, and I think they're going to be super popular throughout this spring and this summer. Um, so I figured I'd show you guys, you know, what you could pair with them. And I thought that this oversized t-shirt is a super cute way to, like, you know, wear the shorts and all that. I thought the white sandals looked really cute with this outfit, but also my black tennis shoes or whatever you're feeling. I have a pink pair of like slide on sandals, like the exact same pink that's on my t-shirt, but I couldn't find them. So I couldn't pair it up with that. But you know, that's a cool way to like make a neon color pop if you have other accessories to match that shade in a t-shirt or something. Okay, I thought I'd bring some jeans out and now plaid pants are one of my favorite things ever. I love plaid pants. Um, this pair is from Forever 21. They're like a jean material, but kind of like jeggings, I guess you could say. Um, and then this t-shirt is my dad's. I think it's a large and I just have a thing for oversized t-shirts. Now with this, I tied it up again, but if you want to leave it down, that's up to you. And I thought I'd pair it up with these black boots because they kind of give it like a dark look you know it kind of makes it a little i don't know it gives it a little something but i really liked how it looked together all right now spring is the perfect time for a sweater dress so i always say like sweater dresses in fall would look super cute with like high 
thigh high boots or whatever but spring is the perfect time to bring them out but i thought that this one in particular would look super cool paired up with an old style pair of sneakers i think even converse would work with this too but a lot of my chucks are just way too dirty to show so i didn't put them on and this sweater dress is from forever 21. First off, excuse my ring light for, you know, peeping into this clip. I don't know why it's there, um, but I pulled out another pair of those biker shorts. This is just a black pair from Forever 21. And then I threw on this sweatshirt because I love zip ups in spring because you can wear them off the shoulder um, and then throw a little highlight on your shoulders and chest. And I don't know, it adds a little pop to your outfit. This sweatshirt in particular is from Las Vegas. It's a Victoria's Secret hoodie and it's one of my favorites. These black shorts are a little longer than the gray pair that I have. Um, I really like the length though of both of them and I paired it up with a jersey. Um, whether you throw on a basketball jersey or I don't know, even a football jersey, baseball, whatever. Um, I think it just looks really cool with the shorts, especially an oversized one. Um, then I threw on these sandals that I grabbed from Target as well. I actually got them the same time as I picked up the other white ones. And then I got this shirt from like a raceway near where I live. In my heart, I feel windbreakers are meant for spring and I have a few of them, but I really love this one. I grabbed it off of Fashion Nova um, and then I'm gonna pair it up with this body glove belt, which I actually pulled off one of my mom's old bathing suits. Um, body glove is like an amazing swimsuit brand. I just love them and this belt is just good quality. Um, it looks really sporty, kind of went with the outfit. I have this pink tank top, just like the purple one I wore earlier from Macy's. I think I got them together. Um, they're just a really nice fabric and they look super cute plain because I know neon colors are also in right now. But I'm actually gonna take one shoulder out and then I'm gonna tuck in the bottom of this tank top. Then I'm throwing on this black long sleeve shirt that I got from Target and I'm going to also take one arm out of the sleeve. I know one sleeve shirts are really in right now, so this is kind of how you can make one yourself. I'm just taking that around the back and tying it around the bottom so it's like crisscross around my back. And then I'm gonna throw a pin in it so that it doesn't move. I'm gonna put back on that body glove belt. It's just a really nice elastic material. I feel like these are also really popular. You could probably pick one up at like PacSun or like Zoomies or something. I don't know, pretty much anywhere. Um, but I'm gonna throw it on on top of the shirt to kind of hide where that other sleeve wrapped around. And I think it's a really cute, sporty spring outfit. I think I mentioned earlier how I love zip ups, so this is gonna be the last outfit. Now this sweatshirt, it looks like, um, what's it called? Oh, Tommy Hilfiger, yeah. It really looks like that and I didn't even intend on buying it for that reason when I saw it, but I picked it up from H&M. Um, my pants are American Eagle and then I'm throwing on those sandals from earlier. It's like a really chill spring outfit and it's a cute look and if it's a chillier day, it would work. We have reached the end of the video, so I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I have tons of other outfit ideas. I just need to find the time to record them. Um, but if you guys enjoyed it, go ahead and smash the like button so I know to make more. Thank you so much for tuning in. You can check out some of my other videos on this next screen, and I will catch you guys next week.